In taking this definite integral, we're going to start with the antiderivatives. The antiderivative of sine is going to be negative cosine. So we'll have negative 4 cosine of 2x all over the derivative of the inner, which is 2, plus the integral of cosine is sine. So we're going to have 1 fourth sine of 4x. All of this evaluated from 0 to pi over 4. And this 4 over 2 is the same as 2. We'll simplify that. Now we're going to plug those limits in. Looking at these limits, 2 times pi over 4 is really pi over 2. And 4 pi over 4 is really pi, and sine of pi is 0. Similarly, cosine of pi over 2 is also 0. Here, 2 times 0 is 0. Cosine of 0 is 1. So we're going to have negative of negative 2 times 1 plus 4 times 0 is 0. Sine of 0 is 0. So the only thing that I have that's not 0 is this negative of negative 2 or positive 2.